Hello guys. Today we are going to see about form properties. So I am going to choose this form and click on it edit application and click on form builder. This form builder will allow you to click on settings in the form builder. Now we are going to make a successful decision in this submission. Now we have many parrots here like datas. Now we are going to submit the form. The automatic submission has been completed. Now we are going to see the form properties. Next step is send email notification. We can send emails anytime, but you have to customize by clicking on it. When you click on the questions, you can change the method of questions. I'll give you the program. It's same process. I'm going to enter the email. When I select the email report, I'll get a mail immediately. I'm going to enter the email. So you can see the email here. After that, you can select the direct answer. When I submit the email, I'll go to the form. If I go to another form or report, I'll choose the same email. If I choose the app report, I'll choose the same email or another video. I'll choose the same email. I'll select the same email. If I choose the same email, it's going to be done retaining whole day, right? We can change our details. After that, we check out the data which you have submitted. To enable the data saving, we have to capture IP rooftop data. If we enable this, it will be captured. We don't need to use data engine for this. If I do this, I'll go to my space. If I submit this, when I see the LAN, if we enable this, it will be captured. If we add fields, it will be added location and IP address. If we give this, it will be captured. If I give this, it will be captured. We can close this now. We can enter this. If I submit this, it will be changed to rename. After submitting, we can click on the link. We can change the place. If needed, we can hide it. There is a button to hide it. I can close it. If there is a button, I can hide it and click here. Likewise, we can unhide this. We can change it. This is for editing the report. When we change the update, it will be redir redirective. It will be not clear. To edit the document, we have to change the button. We have to redirect. After that, we will go to confirm form submission. We will verify the confirmation and submit the document. After that, we will change the draft option. We can cancel the submission if we don't confirm the document. After that, we will save the draft. We can change the draft option. We will submit only half of the date. We don't need to know the rest of the data in the report. We can continue the draft and submit the rest of the data. For example, if I submit draft, the data is not visible. So I can submit the rest of the data. So the phone will be automatically submit the data. When we submit the data, this is what we know in the report. If we save the rest of the data in the draft. We can see the data, we can save the data in the draft. We don't know the record here. We don't know the data of the person, we can see the data in the form. We can edit the data, this is draft option. 
the role we can change is an add a new user we can add a new user to that form which helps some users it can be adaptive in 81 we cannot do it again after one entry this form can be given entry is not more than eight entries if there is an entry in the sixth round there will be seven entries in the eighth round it will delete the fifth entry in the eighth round when i delete there will be eight entries in the tenth round if i go to close it there is a maximum number of five entries allowed if i go to and press nine there is a maximum number of five entries allowed so i can access another entry this is only option if i do not want this i can write zero there is a start time and end time option for example if i drop the attendance meter this time will be nine o'clock morning after that i can access it it is written 12.42 12.42 12.43 I can use 12.48 only I have to be very careful I can access this temporary entry now now I can open the form the form is not opened yet because it is already open at the start time I can write 12.45 so I cannot open the form now I have to close it now I can open the form the form is now open this is the only used by application user or anyone who wants to use it I have named the form as employees I'll change it to employees on board I'll change it to employee on board I'll name it as first edit page if you go there and type record you will see this the first edit page it will add the label as well when you click the tab you can see the field navigation in vertical horizon it is the tab so these are the formula properties we will use them in the next video thank you please like share and subscribe let me know what you guys think about this video in the comment box thank you